I go, do you like, oh yeah. <laughs> Y'all guys, ah, you guys know what time it is. It's time for that vlog. Let's get it. Guys, we are here in Miami and I want to show you guys what I do before I leave to a big event. So we are done at the best chiropractor in Miami. Total chiropractic solution. JJ, how do you feel? I feel amazing. Amazing, you see that light? <laughs> Let's After go. an amazing breakfast, oh. we're off to train with uh, Sensei over there. <laughs> yeah? The man, the man. get a haircut because I need to get beautified oh yeah because this is a mess so yeah see you guys there Haircut is set, look, boom, 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 done. Now time for some Cuban churros. Let's... So we are here buying groceries really quick and this is the most important thing. Come on, come on. Let's get it. Long day of preparation, all set, training, haircut, groceries. Cuban food, Jessica is eating Cuban food, what to do, and Gabriel Iglesias. We're leaving to Dubai in a few hours, and that is what I do on a daily before a tournament. All that good stuff, you already know. Let's go to Dubai. We are in Miami International Airport. Next stop is Istanbul, then we're going to Dubai. It's been an amazing day. I hope you guys really enjoyed, but we did today and uh, comment below if you liked it if you did it like it anyway and make sure you just let us know how much you enjoyed it you didn't enjoy it enjoy it anyway but i'll see you guys in dubai so we made it to dubai yeah we made it to dubai look at that boom dubai oh yeah So, we've made it to Dubai, we're eating, we need to wait like who knows how many hours because it's 3 in the morning, so we can't get a room yet, but we're eating. So after eight and a half hours, I was finally given my room and it was worth it because they upgraded me to a suite and lots, I mean lots of space. Big bed back there, yes, even a sofa. Every, like this place is huge, but yeah, now that's it. I gotta unpack, and after I unpack, I'm probably gonna go to sleep, then eat and train and all that good stuff. But yeah, stay tuned, guys. Here we are, just sightseeing with JJ. Yeah, very beautiful place, man. Very, very nice. And it's not cold. That is the first time in so many trips that it's not freezing. So I am really enjoying it.
Guys, so we made it to the mall, and Jessica, how is it at the mall? It's quite dead here. It is, there's no one. There's literally like two people, and the two people that here work here, but at least we have that view, and yeah. After a uh, supposed to be one hour nap that took five hours, we are here at the gym. We found the Brianer. He's like nine feet tall. And we have Jessica and we're training and it should be good. Done training. It was such a nice training. First training here. I felt a little tight. She felt really good, but tomorrow's the end of the day. I'll feel a lot better tomorrow. Today, now we're gonna eat dinner. It's like nine o'clock, 1 p.m. in Miami, but somehow I'm gonna go to sleep. And then yeah, tomorrow is a uh, registration and getting the seat gi sold on. And yeah, see you guys then. After a great training, here we are with the U.S. team, with Cheryl, Bright, all these people going to the train and go to the mall have some fun enjoy ourselves oh yeah what happened brian <laughs> <Good grief. laughs> As we are here at fam dubai mall this place is amazing what a day amazing training amazing food and sightseeing and now let's see what this mall has to hold Highest high definition video wall in the world, guys. Look at that, 17 billion pixels. I don't know what that means. Uh, do I have, what do you think? Look, Dubai. Yeah, right? Uh -huh. Look at this, this guy, look at that, boom. That is so cool. Look at this. What? My, my boy. Boy, uh, oh yeah, guys, it is competition. They amazing breakfast, and um, yeah, I feel honestly a little nervous, but feel good. I've never been this awake and this feeling this good. So, let's see what today has told.
Okay guys, so today has come to an end and I am very happy with the result. Uh, yeah, it went amazing. I had some tough competition. I'm talking about really, really tough competitions. I had two really high level Japanese athletes in the division. Uh, a guy from Egypt that got second in the World Games a while back. The guy that got third in the Premier League here last year. And I did Super Riempe first round. I got tied for fourth, so I almost didn't make it to the next round. And then I did, we had to do a tiebreaker with the guy from Iran. And it was the first time in WKF at, well, in the WKF point system that it's happened. And well, I won the tiebreaker doing Anandai. And I went off to the third round and in the third round I did Kushanku. And I didn't make it to the, to the uh, semifinals. But yeah, it was an amazing experience. Very, very happy I placed. Uh, 29th out of the top 64 athletes in the world and yeah guys it was an experience and I hope you guys enjoyed the journey I hope you liked it and yeah talk to you guys later guys so I am back home in Miami and I am already packing for the next trip my hero think he's getting hung because I'm leaving in what is it today Tuesday I'm leaving in two days to California for another tournament. As soon as I come back from California, I am here for a day and then I'm leaving off to Austria for a Series A and so on. I have a lot of events coming up, so I just wanted to thank you guys. I hope you really enjoyed the video. Um, I know I enjoyed this trip a lot and I just, want, I just wanted to share this experience with you guys the best way that I could. And I was asked some questions through um, the, the comments and I just wanna answer them real quick. And one of them was the fact of the belts. Um, why do we wear the red belts and the blue belts even if uh, it's all by points now? So I don't know why they do that. I don't know why they chose it, but um, No matter what everyone in the first round is red everyone in the second round is blue Everyone in the third round is red and then in the finals it depends who scored on the previous round who's red or blue Yeah, so that's how it works, but why I have no idea and some other things you guys asked me about a video on how to tie my belt that is coming up very soon um just guys bear with me it, it's it's been a long journey and um i have another trip like i said it's it's been crazy um but i am so happy i'm so excited i'm more motivated than ever and um i just want to show you guys really quick the experience from this trip um it's crazy how i've been traveling so much and just now I'm beginning to like know myself and and by that I mean like I'm knowing myself in the sense of how should I stretch, how long it takes, how to mentally prepare, uh, how to understand my body, what to eat while I'm traveling, how to tra how to pack for my travels, pack food especially, not only ramen noodles, I love ramen noodles but not only that and I am so excited guys so please 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 like the video give it a thumbs up and comment down your favorite part and what you want to see in the next vlog the next vlog will be probably a tournament i don't know but if you guys really want to see a completely different vlog that doesn't have to do with tournaments let me know and the more you guys agree on a vlog i'll do it, it this is up to you guys i want you guys to know the experience i want to share with you guys and just comment below like it share it it really helps a lot the more the videos get out there, the more encouraged I am to keep making them for you. So please, please, please like, comment, and share for more. More vlogs coming soon.